just talk. Hi guys. Okay, I'm not gonna make this video long. I'm just gonna make it short and right to the point. I did not wanna do this video, but I have realized that I have to. When I make the choice to open up and share a relationship, whether that's for a week or six years on YouTube, you guys watch and take a liking to and subscribe and love, like, whatever it is, hate. It is only right that when and if that relationship ends to come and talk to you guys and just be open and honest. So Dalton and I broke up and this was a couple weeks ago. I didn't want to, a couple weeks ago, come on here and make that video. One, because obviously both of us were going through a very rough time. I didn't want to come on here and cry and make a scene and all dramatic. I just didn't want to do that. I hope you guys can respect that. I know it would be clicky and it would get a ton of views, blah, 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 but that's just not what I personally wanted for my relationship with Dalton to end like, if that makes sense. And I just didn't want the drama brought to it, but I realize now I'm getting tons of messages asking questions, what's happening? Are we still together? Do we break up? I am not gonna go into the reasons as to why. There are lots of things that I share online. I'm very open with my personal life, but there are some things as well that YouTubers in general um, should and need to keep private and personal, especially for my mental health. I feel like I just need to keep that personal between Dalton and I. So you guys know about two years ago, uh, Dalton and I took a break. That is different from right now. We are broken up and have been for a couple weeks. Honestly, like if I just wanna be very vague as the reasoning, there were things that we just couldn't connect on, like very, not, not connect, we connected a lot, like on everything, but there were a lot of things that just, weren't matching up and they were quite big things and we did try to work them out we tried for a very long time there were also things with me um from past things that i couldn't get over and i just like kept thinking about and it just like i couldn't like i i couldn't stop thinking about and i couldn't bring myself out of that what happened to me in the past i'm definitely not gonna throw anyone under the bus that is not what i'm doing here i'm not about to start drama um, i love dalton very much i am so appreciative for everything that he's done for me and we've done for each other and how he supported me and been there for me not only youtube but with like my health my family what i want in life just everything like that like i do really appreciate him and love him and i know like people want drama around these things but it really isn't we are so still friends we talk here and there um, it's friendly there's no bad blood there's no evilness there's no yelling throwing anything there's nothing like that that happened or is happening now he is moved out and has been moved out I know it's like a huge change and might be a shock to some people I just want to tell you guys that when a relationship ends it's not like the end of everything you're not done forever you're just gonna try your hardest to be positive pick yourself back up and try to make the breakup as civil and respectful as you can which we did in this case and I want all my younger viewers to know that when you do have a breakup it isn't just like this horrible crazy thing it is very mature and good for people to just like sit down and talk and say their different and if you cannot like if you've tried and tried and tried and cannot sort out those differences It's not some horrible thing to break up. So the vlog channel that we have together chomp vlogs um, Basically, we have talked about it and I am just gonna use that as my vlog channel from now on like my daily life My friends my family traveling adventures stuff like that that I wouldn't put on this channel here And he's 100% okay with that. That's what we talked about So I will still be posting vlogs on there. So if you guys, you know wanted to see us as a couple I understand if you want to unsubscribe if you just want to see me that's what's gonna be happening over there who knows in the future he might even be in vlogs because we are still friends we still talk we still have the same group of friends like it's not some evil bad thing we don't hate each other now people have been asking me like oh do you think he'll be back with him in the future nobody knows what the future holds but this is the right decision and I, I I just know it is the right decision and I feel very confident in that of course it's really sad and I've had like weeks to cope with this and be around friends and family and you know be around just like my own space and headspace and journal and get all my thoughts out so if people are gonna come out here saying that you know I'm not sad or I'm not crying you don't have to cry to show emotion and that's why I didn't film this video a while ago because I just wanted to collect my thoughts and do it when I was ready and um, when time has passed that I can 
talk to you guys. I'm not dissing anyone, other YouTuber, anyone who has done that. It's just not what I wanted for my relationship personally. Um, the animals, they are definitely still his animals as well. They are not just my animals. The cats and my dog love him so much, so he is more than welcome to come over here anytime and see them that he wants and he knows that. I don't know if I'm disabling comments. I just don't want people to drag some you know, one of us under the bus or make assumptions because you really, really do not know. And we were together for six years. That's a long time. So it isn't just like, you know, something that randomly happened that it couldn't be fixed. Um, stuff happens in life and it is positive to grow and shape your life healthy to remain that positive vibe with that person and still be able to talk with them have a conversation because you had them in your lives for so long so that's what i wish onto everyone here every young viewer of mine old like older viewer anyone that if you have a relationship with somebody and you spend your time with them and open up your life to them that when in when and if it does end that you can still have those good vibes because you shared something so special with somebody. That is why I have been a little bit low key on social media lately. A lot of people have been noticing these past few weeks. I'm not really on Twitter replying or tweeting. Um, I posted like one Instagram picture. My videos, a lot of them were pre-recorded and now I don't have any pre-recorded videos. So today was my first day that I got back and just started filming. I'm sorry that I kept you guys in the dark, but I hope that you can understand from this video that I'm just like, I don't wanna make a relationship that was special to be um, drama filled or a mockery out of, or I didn't wanna come on here crying and like spilling all my emotions when I didn't have my correct thoughts together. I hope you guys can respect that. Who knows what the future holds? I just wanna keep positive right now and tell everyone that we are okay. We're still talking. It's not obviously what it used to be, but it's not bad blood. Okay, this video sucked to make, but I appreciate you guys for watching and for everyone who's going to support both me and Dalton. Do not send negative or bad vibes to Dalton. Thank you guys so much for watching this and for being there and just seeing what the future will bring. So I hope you guys have a good day and if you are struggling or going through something right now, don't beat yourself up about it. We all go through things and I just hope and I'm sending all the positive energy I can to you guys that things will start looking up and and you guys have a bright future. Try on everything today to be positive and look towards something good in your life. I love you guys and I will talk to you guys all in my next video.